Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to this quick tutorial. My name is Jovan Lawrence. I will be guiding you through the process of retouching the image. Um, we're going to go ahead and use some color. We're going to cover the lips in this tutorial. Let's get started. First thing I want to do is I want to double click into the window pane. Just double click one time. And I'm going to use this image here that's, in my, that's on my desktop. I'm going to press Z so I can zoom in some. All right. Now I want to add some color to the lips. I want to do something that's going to kind of accentuate her eyeshadow that she has on. So we'll pick like a, something like a magenta. Uh, first thing I want to do is I want to go to the right hand side on the layers panel. I want to hit Command J one time. Okay, then I want to go over to the adjustments panel. I want to look for color balance. Click that one time. Then the next thing I want to do, folks, is I want to go ahead and hit Command I to invert. That's after you've clicked into the box once. Okay. And the next thing I want to do, folks, I want to hit B for brush. All right, let's go ahead and hide this a little bit to the side. Push that over to the side some. All right, um, wait a minute, I didn't mean to do that. Just take that out. Just push that back over, like maybe right here in the corner. All right, folks, um, I want to go ahead and hit the X key so I can toggle this area over here. I'm going to hit the X key to toggle the black from the white. All right, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to Go back over to, you see the scale, click that one time, and I want to change the magenta over to the, more on the purple side. Maybe something like a minus 34, 36, something like that. Let's leave it at 36 for right now. We can always go back and change it. Once I do that, folks, I want to go back and make sure I click the black box again, so that allow me to go ahead and brush. Um, let's zoom in one more time. Okay. And go back to my brush and start brushing some color onto her lips. It's going to give her a nice little outline to kind of like get it started. It's going to take one ring around, kind of like outline it. You don't have to outline it this way, it's just something I do to. Um, you know, prevent from being like too messy. Okay. And then once I do that, I hit the corners. That way I ain't gotta come back in the corners no more. So we just color inside the lines, you know, color inside the crease of her lip. If you mess up, you can always hit the X key and just go back over that. Like that there. You want to make it faster, just increase the brush size a little bit by pressing the uh, the asterisk, the asterisk button that allow you to toggle the size of your brush. And folks, it doesn't have to be perfect because what's going to happen is we're going to go ahead and, and feather this so it can be lighter anyway. I'm using 100% opacity just to show you this on Photoshop just so you can see it through the tutorial but you know it doesn't have to be 100% perfect and it won't be perfect for the sake of this video okay go ahead and clean that up just a little bit alright folks so you know what I'm satisfied for that for right now I just want to show you oh, let me show you the magic of what happens after this next thing I want to do is I want to go ahead and zoom out out a little bit go ahead and use the feather on the properties panel and just feather away and feather is going to what's going to happen is it's going to make a lighter so that's way too light so maybe we want something in the in the nine ten pixel that's a good feather that's a good feather right there and as you can see in this area it's a little messed up so like I said I can always zoom back in my brush and just go ahead and just clear that area a little bit make that a little lighter and just paint in more alright folks so let's zoom out so you can see how that looks ladies and gentlemen what I want to do is I want to go ahead and feather it a little bit more 12 pixels Let's go ahead and turn that eye off so you can see the before and after. This is my before and this is my after, folks. Ladies and gentlemen, please comment, rate, and subscribe. 
This is Javon Lawrence. Thank you for watching.